What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. We're taking a look at Gotham Knights here running on my RTX 3060 PC here and while I'm personally loving the game so far and I've got about 9-10 hours into it, the performance is a big issue and we definitely want to get that straightened out. Let's start off with the settings and I'm not going to test a bunch of settings in this video like I normally would because there's just no point we're not able to do anything with the performance here. But I do have things with 1440p DLSS is on quality though it's probably not doing anything, no V-Sync, ray tracing's on, everything else is turned off for motion blur and all of that and then the highest settings we can run other than that and you'll notice here in menu we're getting 99% GPU usage the way that we should with decent frame times and things look pretty normal but once we get into the gameplay that's when you notice a lot of the issues we're not able to utilize our GPU the way that we should it's rare that I see games with this type of a problem if you're on a super easy to run game like a pixel art game or 2d side scroller yeah this can happen on a 3060 or something where of course you're not going to need all of that but everything runs normal but with this game what's happening is there's some type of issue or bug I have gone through every fix and trick and everything I've learned from over the years to try to get it to, to fix to try to get it to use the GPU the way that it's should and I don't know if this is an on purpose thing or a glitch or bugs in the game or what it is but it's definitely a big issue when it comes to Gotham Knights here on PC and I've tested this on multiple PCs from a 2060, 3060, 1050 Ti and my Steam Deck and they all have the exact same problem. And that's a shame because this game very much like Spider-Man on the Steam Deck could easily run a 30 or 40 FPS lock if we didn't have this problem. And here on my RTX 3060 with all the graphics set up and DLSS and all that, we should easily be able to use all of our GPU and have a nice smooth frame time and be playing this game at well over 60 FPS most of the time without a problem or at least locked 60 without dropping down in the 30s, 40s or 50s throughout the game. Now here's something else interesting. When you're inside of a building, like here trying to do something, I've noticed this throughout the game. Anytime I've gone in somewhere, I go back to 99% GPU usage. Frame times are great, high frame rate, same settings. Everything looks and feels fantastic. It's exactly how I want the entire game to run and feel, not just when I'm in a menu or when I'm inside of a building. And even here, same at the Belfry, I will get that higher usage and things run much better. And even if you want to go over here and play on the arcade a little bit and play some Spy Hunter, which I just found this out recently, so I thought this was pretty cool. But I can even be in the Belfry and play this with much better GPU usage and better frame rate than I can when I get out into the main game. And for me, that's just a big issue with this because I am really, really enjoying the game itself, which is another thing that I kind of want to talk about with all the performance issues aside that should be able to get fixed with some patches and stuff in the future. I do hope they do that because I am really enjoying the game and I personally kind of disagree with a lot of the negative reviews I'm seeing out there. The mechanics in the game for combat for each character are pretty good as well as the progression and everything else that I'm running into. There's a lot to dive into with crafting and modding and that type of thing and all of it's working pretty well for me and as someone who likes a lot of option without being too overwhelmed I feel like they're kind of in a good middle ground here and I'm personally just really enjoying the gameplay, all the different characters and definitely the story here but I know everybody's going to have their own opinion and of course they're comparing it to our great Batman series that we had back in the day but anyways guys let me know if you're playing this game at all or enjoying it or what kind of performance issues you're having with it hit me up in those comments if you haven't already and subscribe thumbs up ring the bell all that kind of stuff thanks a lot for coming to watch as always and i'll see you in the next one